Hi guys, welcome to a quick one from uh, Otto's Garage. So we're just having a look at the Audi TT uh, Mark II and uh, they've got an inherent rear light earth issue basically the um, the wire for the rear lights um, the earth wire just isn't up to it and what you find is that the earth terminal burns out on the light plug lead so what I've done is I've removed the back light um, you can see how that's done probably someone else has put a YouTube video on there but I'm just going to show you what I've done to try and upgrade this earth so this is the uh, rear light cluster off the back of the TT and basically you want to take the, the lamp unit out in its entirety and then undo these screw fixings around here ignore this wire for the moment um, down to that position there so they all come out and then basically the two separate just slides out and you can see on the inside of it basically the metal tracks which carry the voltage to the different bulbs dead easy to find out what's the earth because that's the one that's continuous it runs from light to light all the way through goes around there comes on the other side all the way down here bah, 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 and it's the outside track down there and then ultimately that goes into the back of the uh, plug connector and i'll show you the back side of that so inside the plug connector you can see in there that that one terminal that's the earth terminal and that is burnt out and what you'll find is that the lights will get um dimmer and dimmer um, on the actual unit as you look at them and eventually they'll fail altogether and that's basically what's happened in this instance so what i've done is we're going to bypass that earth completely i've drilled a little uh, six mil hole in here put a six mil bolt in with a washer on it and that's clamped down onto this earth track so we've now got an earth bolt and then on the back side put a, um, a little washer on it a eyelet with a fly lead and then that's just got a bullet connector at the other end and then basically locking nut on there so that is not going to come loose we've got a real decent thickness of wire on there now and we've got ourselves a good earth so what i'm going to do is i'm going to put the light unit back together and then we'll have a look on the car and just see what we're going to do at that end to make that continuity of the earth correct so when you're making up these um connectors go with these crimp ones um don't go with solder joints solder joints can crack so you're better off just crimping them on but then what i do is i always put over the top of it a little bit of heat shrink tube and that basically uh, just helps to reinforce the back of the wire there. and then we're just going to apply a little bit of heat with the heat gun on that just to shrink it down so you can see there now let's just get that in focus there you go you can see there now that the heat shrink just gives a bit of support to the back of the uh, the wire there and uh, that just helps it stop um, moving around and, and getting loose right so on the car itself is i've just drilled a little hole up here and put a rivet nut in it uh, and then we can basically attach our lead via a six mil bolt into that and the rivet nut's going to give a nice tight uh, connection onto the bodywork so we should have a good earth on that one um if you don't know how to put a rivet nut in google it simple as that and there she is so that's the other end of our fly lead we've got a female bullet connector on the end of that and then uh, you can see there it's tied up nicely against the bodywork and it's kept out of the way so all i need to do now is offer up the light unit again connect the bullet connectors together and then we should have ourselves a good earth and some decent shiny lights again and there you go so that's offside and near side so we've got a nice earth there that was dull as anything before and it really wasn't doing what it should have been doing they're now equal that's cool well i hope that's helped you tt guys out uh it's definitely a mod worth doing because that earth is very weak anyway if you like it uh click like if you want to subscribe to otto's garage please do so catch you later bye bye <laughs>